What's up, bitches? <laughs> so I completely forgot to record the process, but we're kind of in the middle of it now. I'm going to be dyeing my hair. I told y'all in my last video that I need to dye my hair again, but normally I dye my hair black, but I'm kind of over the whole black phase. So I'm going to be doing it this color. Hopefully it comes out like this or similar to this or something. I don't really know. We don't really know what we're doing if you want to get technical. <laughs> She's over here bleaching my hair. Hopefully it's fine. And then I was going to record like when I went to the store and stuff, but I had got on the phone and stuff. So I wasn't really paying attention. And then when I got home, I started talking about stuff and I forgot about that too. But yeah, we just in the process of dying, well, bleaching it. As you can see, I don't even know if it's turning or nothing really. She it said it kind of is, but I, I mean, I can't see the back, so. Hopefully it all works out. She's so heavy handed. See, it's turning a little bit in the front, like right here. It's getting a little lighter. Yeah, but my roots are already light. Yeah, but this is like a really light brown. Your roots are a darker brown. I know, that's why I need more of it on my ends than on my roots because if not, her head is going to match my hair and I'm going to look like my forehead is bigger. I'm putting it on the ends. I probably shouldn't even have put none on my roots. But, well. I mean, hindsight is twenty twenty. <laughs> is, that the, is that what they say? I don't even know what you're talking about. Uh -huh. <laughs> It's like much more wet than it was before. I feel like we had needed to add more. I just hope this works out. I don't want my front to be too light and blend in with my forehead. It's done that before and I hated it. Cause my fucking we'll forehead. Just wash the front. And if we feel like it's getting too light, we'll wash it off. My forehead was too big. Like I already got a big forehead. And then when your hair blends in with your skin, hmm. So if we feel like it's getting too light in the front, we'll just start washing that part off. Hey, JJ. <laughs> Doing it's kind of hard to see. It's like... My hair look big. Like, put it to the top of your head. Like, just the ends are starting to turn a little bit. You better hurry up. It's pretty, like the color that it is here, that's what it's getting like here in the middle. I know, okay. it needs that's to get like that at the ends, not the middle. My ends ain't even changing. Give it some time. Yeah, but then the longer I leave it in at the root, my hair gonna fall out. That's why I took it out the last time I dyed my hair and my hair is fucking like green. Well, you know, if you still see too much blonde, yeah, I'm gonna have to wipe we'll this take off. It out. Look, it's already matching my forehead on the front. I'm gonna have to take the front out. Damn, boy. We could take it out, and then I we know next time we die, we can just do like literally. Ooh, Girl, I'm gonna be mad. Cause around here is. I know. I'm about to wipe it off. Y'all, I'll be back because I'm about to take this stuff off in the front. Because it's in your, the back, like it's coated. So it should, given the time, it should start to turn. So if you want to take it out in the front, we can take it out in the front. I want to take it out in the front. Let's do it. I'm going to be looking bald headed and I keep seeing all these people keep bleaching their hair and that shit just keep falling out. So I don't know why the hell I even decided to do this in the first place. Look at that. And you see if I would have left this any longer, it already my forehead already looked big. Cause like you see? Like even all the way up to like here, it's already turning. It's just getting these root I mean these ends. Cause you see you see how far up? Yeah. It's already bleached. I ain't cutting my hair. Again. That's out. The How long are you supposed to keep this on? You're supposed to just eyeball it, but I mean, I ain't trying to have my roots fall out, yeah. 
Yeah, I'll be back. Let me figure this out. I'm back. This is the process so far. Of course, my roots are bright as hell. I did take it out, so it didn't get to sit as long over here. But y'all see this? Like, I'm a little stressed out. I'm not going to lie. A little stressed out. It did kind of lighten the color on the rest of my hair. Oh, my shit is big. But it did kind of, you know, lighten it. But not as light as I was expecting or anything. But I'm going to still put on the hair dye. I just blow dried it out because it makes it easier for me to, you know, apply hair dye. So once I start to add the hair dye, I'll come back so that y'all can see me doing that or see my sister doing it. And yeah, and then we'll have the finishing result. If it doesn't work out, I don't know what I'm going to do. You know, I'm just have to let it do what it do for a while and just keep using that same box dye over and over on my hair till I get the color that I'm looking for. And yeah, because like y'all, my roots and everything are so blonde that it's just, it's a lot. I don't know how it looks underneath or nothing, but yeah, I'll be back to you. Okay. I'll be back to y'all whenever I get to actually applying the dye to my hair. Hey guys, we're back. Girl, we just finished eating. Man, this light in our house is booty. <laughs> it's because of all the MSG in your food. Oh, you know that? Uh uh. Girl, no. I don't even know that. Nah, I work at a doctor's office, so I'm not. But MSG makes you sleepy. That's why when you eat Chinese food, you get real sleepy because they put a lot of MSG. Yeah, I'm tired. It's just what's in the food naturally, I think. But I'm not sure. But I know it's the MSG. So somebody said some dough. Start small. The best say it don't gotta be perfect either. You just throw some dye on there. <laughs> you know this is going on YouTube, right, Michaela? Hey, don't get taken. <laughs> you hear me? Huh. It's going on YouTube. Oh. <laughs> 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 but we in the dying stage crazy. now guys my skin looks very nice mine too and it really ain't behind this camera mine is behind this camera my skin is nice period. You know, you want to i got i got nice you, skin you, but you think i'm lying you want to talk to her <laughs> can you tell my mama hey because she hi <laughs> hello <laughs> no my sister so <laughs> I'm dying it like a blondish color. Yeah, I bleached it, but oh. <laughs> I like this. I like this color. I like yeah. I like this color, but yes, I do. I don't even be doing nothing. I feel like it's lighter. I even feel like the darker part is lighter than it was. It's like it light. It is light, but. Hopefully it takes all right. Yeah. That's just I don't know. That's just, that's what I'm about. Uh, I don't know. I feel like even her dark is lighter. I it, really do though. It's it like did a, get lighter. It's I'm like sure a red it. tinge to it. It don't be too bad. I'll come back around for the end. <laughs> Y'all, I'm nervous. I don't know how this is about <laughs> She feeling herself. Look at this bump. It's not really even a bump no more. It's like it's a scar. I feel like I look pale. Disclaimer, do not critique me because I'm not a hairdresser. Oh yeah. We just doing so don't that whole stuff. What you see me doing <laughs> We doing it how we do. Well really, she should have started from the front. I we know that, but I ain't nobody got time for that, okay? It's easier. I mean, you can start from the front, but to me, it's just easier to start from the back. It is. It's like you don't think about starting from the front. Maybe you're a cosmetologist and you just know that. But yeah. I just think start from the back. I feel like it's just too much starting from the front. Like, you just got the hair dangling in your face, and it's just, you don't need all that. And then you start breaking out, you get bumps all over your skin because the <laughs> lady done let the hair sit on your face. And who got time for that? Not me. <laughs> got some craters and shit. <laughs> oh my goodness. It hurts. It 
It hurts. Yeah, you ripping it. Oh, girl, I'm just trying to brush it through. I'm sorry. I'm heavy handed. That's she why I could be a cosmetologist. And I'm really not that tender headed because I be getting my hair braided. It hurts, but it's not like. I don't know. She be pulling your head back and shit as she's pulling it. Maybe it'll darken up a little bit with this hair color. I don't know about that, but. <laughs> my roots, because that color is darker than my really hair, like, I think. I like this color though. If I could have dark to light to this color, I would like that. Yeah. Because y'all look, it really don't look like it's anything, right? But ain't no going back. I'm gonna get back to y'all whenever we're almost done with this process. Cause okay, y'all. So it's on there. Um, uh, <laughs> I don't know how this is gonna turn out. <laughs> but I said it for 30 minutes. So after 30 minutes, I'll be back. Well, I'm gonna wash it. So I'm gonna just come back whenever it's like done, done. Okay. Hey guys, so I am back. This is my hair. This is the end result. Let me get y'all a little close up. Hopefully you can see it good. Here's the back. It's so cute. Like I'm so happy. This is not the exact color that I wanted. It is a little still more darker, um, brassy. This, let me see hold on yeah on camera it's showing a little bit more brassy it's not as brassy in person it's still kind of brassy but not as brassy as it's showing on camera but this is really cute i do like it i am happy i'm not gonna touch it again for a little while but i was going more for if you can see i have two tones in my hair it's lighter from my root area can y'all see that well you can see it right here well actually when i hold this up it's kind of better to kind of see it but as you can see it's like a little more blonde towards the top that's more of the color that i wanted but it didn't really take well because my hair was so dark from dyeing it jet black over and over and over for a really long time i want to say over for longer than two years or so, way, way longer than that. I've been dying my hair black pretty much since I was in middle school. Yeah, about middle school. I'm 21 now, but yeah, anyways, it didn't really take as well to the end. So I did, guys, I did. I bleached my hair twice. I know, what? Shocking. And it still looks good. But, um... Yeah, I bleached it yesterday and I let it sit and my roots started turning really blonde as you can see now and as you've seen in the previous clips and I was a little shook. I was just like, I didn't know what to do. Honestly, I was just like, it never works out for me. Like dyeing my hair never works out. I don't know why. Only time my hair does what it's supposed to do when I dye it is when I dye it black, of course. But I was really tired of black and I've been wanting to go lighter for the longest. And it's been over like a year since I've been deciding I want to go light. I just didn't do it because I was trying to let it naturally fade out. And then, you know, my natural hair come out. But for my hair being so dark so often, it was kind of hard for that dark to fade so light. But yeah, my natural hair is like a, a real light brown with like goldish hints up in there my mom tells me i honestly don't remember because like i said i've been dying my hair black for so many years but yeah i bleached it twice i bleached it yesterday and then i put the hair dye on it then i didn't like the color really i mean the color was cute i'm not gonna lie i thought it was cute it's just not what i was looking for and it was still too dark in my opinion but i'll show y'all like a little clip because i did kind of do a close out video because I thought that was going to be the end but then I decided you know just do it again you know yellow <laughs> but here's a little clip <laughs> but yeah that's how my hair was looking a couple hours ago well more than a couple hours ago pretty much like this morning and I thought it was cute I did like it but it's not what I personally wanted I really wanted a color like this this 
blonde part at the top but i will get there i'm just feeling myself y'all like this is cute my boyfriend had no idea that i was bleaching my hair again um he didn't even know the first time i was bleaching and coloring my hair nobody really did i just kind of was just like fuck it like like i said i've been thinking about doing it for the longest and i was just like you know what do it <laughs> if you don't do it you're never gonna do it so i was just like go ahead and do it so yeah i went ahead and did it you know like i said bleached it twice it did not mess up my hair my hair did not fall out i was very scared though i'm not gonna lie i was a little nervous my sister could tell i was nervous because she was the one bleaching it and we are not professionals at any of this so we were both very nervous about the whole thing but it came out pretty decent I do like it. It is cute. My hair is growing. It's getting a lot longer, a lot healthier. And you're probably like, then why would you, you know, bleach it? But honestly, you can bleach your hair and it can be still healthy as long as you know what you're doing. Or at least you, you know, deep condition and you take care of your hair. I take care of my hair, of course, now. But I do take care of my hair. I let the conditioner sit in my hair for about two hours after I bleached it and I just let it soak and I had um a Walmart bag yes a Walmart bag I had a Walmart bag tied on my head and I let it soak while I did my sister's hair and then right after I did her hair I washed that out she put the dye on there I washed that out and then bam this is how it turned out and I really do like it I will go a little bit lighter in the future you know when it's time to touch my hair back up, maybe. It just depends on how it takes. If I get to this color, I'm completely fine because that's what the that's the color I wanted to begin with. But yeah, y'all. Um, I know that part was a little all over the place because I'm just a little excited. Like I haven't seen myself with with my natural hair this light really in a long time. Um, I tried to go blonde a long, long, long time ago when my hair was real damaged and it was just straight, but I wasn't really feeling it. But now that my hair is curly, I kind of, I kind of like it, you know, it's cute. But yeah, I'm just going to end this here because I will just keep on going. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this ratchet little video because it was not well put together it was really just kind of thrown together but i still hope you guys enjoyed make sure to like comment subscribe turn on my post notifications so you don't miss out on any more of my future uploads and i will see you guys in my next upload bye bitches